Channel 5 Weather, brought to you by First Choice. Hi, I'm Sean Welby. Well, I hope you've had a lovely day today. We've got a bit of a mixed bag this week, weather-wise, some drier days, followed by some scattered and heavy thundery showers. Now, this evening, well, after a showery day, it is turning largely dry and staying fairly mild as well. The showers just clumping together over northern Scotland at the moment, giving some long and heavy spells of rain here. Perhaps the odd rumble of thunder in the mix and some torrential downpours there, so do take care on the roads. But overnight, these showers will start to clear away into the North Sea. There'll be a few left behind for Northern Ireland, Western Scotland, perhaps Northwest England as well. But for the bulk of the UK, a dry, bright, and mild start tomorrow morning with temperatures generally in double digits. Now, as we head through the course of the day, a lot of those showers will fizzle out. Many areas will be dry and we'll have a brief ridge of high pressure dominating our weather. So let's have a close look in Northern Ireland at lunchtime. 14 to 17 degrees, but looking a little bit showery still here. Uh, for Scotland, fairly cloudy, a little bit brighter towards the north. One or two showers here and there, but largely dry conditions. Brighter for Northern England. England in the north, the west and the east. As we head down towards the Midlands, you can see temperatures in the high teens, but pushing into the low 20s over East Anglia and the southeast of England. And here it will start to feel quite warm and muggy. Down the south coast, also looking very nice and lovely clear spells of sunshine. And over Wales, again, a largely dry day. Temperatures in the high teens, a very pleasant afternoon for most. Now, as we head through the evening and overnight, one or two showers again blowing through on this northwesterly flow. And it will affect parts of Northern Ireland and Western Scotland. And then on Wednesday, We'll start to get a warm front heading towards the south. This will bring some heavier rain later on to the southern counties of England, but for many, again, staying largely dry. Channel 5 weather, brought to you by First Choice.